Yes, entertainment. Hi, folks. My name is Shelda Smith of Chevy Yes Entertainment, and you have tuned into the fourth season and the ninth episode of Simba NYC TV from out of Brooklyn, New York. Labor Day is over, but I just want to keep the party going just a little bit longer. So today in our studio we have, from Trinidad and Tobago, soca artist Kyle Casey Cowie. You are in for a treat. Don't go anywhere. But before we meet him, we're going to go on a commercial break, and then we'll be right back. See you in a few. Hi folks! You know who I am. I'm Shelby Smith of Shelby S Entertainment, and I'm the host of one of the hottest shows, if not the hottest show in New York City, and it's Simba NYC TV. A lot of you artists, you've been reaching out to me on Facebook and IG and saying that you want to be on this show. But you don't live in the tri-state area. So I'm going to fix that. We are going to be providing Skype interviews. I want to be able to show all the dopest artists, not only in New York, but all around the world. So, you know what you can do? You can reach out to me by my Facebook, which is Shelby Smith, by email, which is S H E L L Y S W K R S S at gmail.com. You can go to my entertainment page, Shelly S. You can also friend me on Skype. And the name on Skype is Shelda Smith. Send me a link to your music and your time zone. That's so important because I don't want to be calling you while you're sleeping. So link me, link me, link me. And you can be an artist on Simba NYC TV show. Yes, it's all about you. Made in Brooklyn, New York City. Tasty pepper sauce make everything taste good. It makes everything taste good. It makes everything taste good. It makes everything taste good. For all inquiries, please contact 646-657-4277 or email at Elaine's Tasty Pepper Sauce at gmail.com. And we're back. And sitting next to me, as I promised, is Kyle Casey. Kawi. Kyle Kesey Kawi. I like that. I <laughs> you said good day. You said good day. Kyle Kesey I was I Kowie. was schooled in the green room, so yeah. it's Kyle Kesey Kawi. Kawi. It's a nice flow. <laughs> I'm just so happy to have you here. You're from Trinidad, you're on vacation, and you were gracious enough to come and pay Simba NYC TV a visit. Yeah, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. Let's 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 get it going. Oh. You know, I'm, it's, it's great to be here, you know, for me. Um, not a stranger to New York, not a stranger to Brooklyn. I have a lot of family in NYC and in Florida. You know, I'm same way I want to pay respects to all the flood victims, you know, you know, and out there in Texas. You know, and um yeah, we here. Soka, um the Labor Day was, was great. You know, we had a nice Labor Day. I was at the side tripping with my with my family. You know, and that's where I met you. You know, yes, at, at the Labor Day at the side of the road. But yeah, it's great to be here. You know, I'm happy, I'm blessed. See, yeah. that, that's what happens when I go out. I never know who I'm going to meet. Yeah, you never know. <laughs> <laughs> I want you to tell me about your first steps into the music business. Yeah, music, um, a, a journey thus far. I'm, mm -hmm. I'm, I'm just started. You know, but I have had a journey. You know, um, I started playing the steel pan. Mm -hmm. You know, that is our, our national instrument of Trinidad and Tobago. You know, I'm a proud pan player, mm -hmm. you know, for many years. You know, but I accomplished so much at a young age playing the steel pan. Um, sometimes it's, it's difficult to stay mm -hmm. to stay in one area. You know, where your progression is needed. You know, and you want to build all the time. Mm -hmm. You know, so I, I moved on to to be to, to be a singer. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You have family that sing. I mean, you just. I mean, there are a lot of pan players out here that can't make that kind of transition. <laughs> so you you have to have something. 
So is there family that, that sings? Is yeah, we have um, a couple of family members that sing, mm -hmm. and um, some that also play the steel pan. And my little brother, he's a, he's a ace panist. We mm -hmm. call them crack shots in general. And today, <laughs> we call them crack shots. Oh, we need to shout, <laughs> shout out the crack shots. <laughs> so shout out my little brother yes. Christian, you know, Kawik. Um, mm -hmm. So yeah, that's that that my foundation in yes. music. Mm -hmm. That is where I was mm -hmm. introduced to music as a steel pan player in Trinidad and Tobago. Yeah. So what did you discover? Because I have to ask this. When did you discover that you could sing? We know that you, your hands are great, but when did you say to yourself, you know what, I can sing, I can make this into to a career? I mean, I was always seeing it. Um, I was around a lot of artists. You know, I would always make this this, this example. Um, a famous soca artist right now, um, Irfan Alves. Mm -hmm. You know, I've been around mm -hmm. him for, for so many years. Mm -hmm. And you know, him, him being an artist, you know, it was always there. I always tell him I got a, a on the job experience being a, around him. Mm -hmm. You know, I used to accompany him playing the part while he's yes. singing. So when it was time for me to sing, it was like second meeting and I sing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And speaking of singing, I'm kind of like we know that you're a soca artist, you know, I've seen your your performance, it's high energy. But I wanna show them just a little bit of the softer side of you. Yeah, and I really <laughs> want to show this because I want to show you that he can sing. He has range, he has versatility, and I think it's important that people see that. You know, sometimes we just see the one side, but I want to show them that you're well-rounded. Yeah, it's all, it's all part of being a musician. A musician. Yeah. So <laughs> what I'm going to do is there is a video. And the song is called The Guarantee. Yeah, The Guarantee. And we're going to also see his love, his soft side. <laughs> so watch the video. It's called The Guarantee. Don't go anywhere. And we'll be right back with more Casey. Yeah, Casey. Cowie. Yes. I remember. I take your hand and I hold you close when we cut this cake yeah, and take this toast. Dance to our song on center floor. I'm still amazed by your beauty, my love. Me amor. See, I remember when we first met. Headed on set, moving fast as a jet I remember Remember all the trips that we made The good things we did The loving we made And I remember all the bad things too Like when things were horrible between me and you But we kept it together Yeah, we pulled through And tonight I'm marrying you I'll be more than you want from me With your eyes, girl, you would see No if no buts, no maybe Tonight is a guarantee And all your dreams lost in the sea Healthy recovery No if, no buts, no maybe Tonight is a guarantee I vow, you vow, we vow Till death do us apart I know I mean it, did you mean it? Yeah, I mean it, did you? Yeah, I did, straight from the heart Cause things may get tough, may be tougher But I know we can do it together Keep it 100 all the time And everything would be just fine See I remember when we first met Headed on sets, moving fast as a jet I remember, remember all the trips that we made The good things we did, the love and we made and I remember all the bad things too Like when things were horrible between me and you But we kept it together Yeah, we pulled through And tonight I'm marrying you I'll be more than you want from me With your eyes, girl, you would see No if, no buts, no maybe Tonight is a guarantee And all your dreams lost in the sea Healthy recovery No if, 
no buts, no maybe Tonight is a guarantee See I remember when we first met Hit it on set, moving fast as a jet I remember Remember all the trips that we made The good things we did The loving we made And I remember all the bad things too Like when things were horrible between me and you But we kept it together Yeah, we pulled through And tonight I'm marrying you I'll be more that you want from me With your eyes, girl, you would see No if, no but, no maybe Tonight is a guarantee And all your dreams lost in the sea Healthy recovery No if, no but, no maybe Tonight is a guarantee Hurt you Leave you. No, no, I can do you that. Tonight is a guarantee. And we're back. <laughs> I'm, I'm laughing because, you know, whenever I hear a love song on the show, we say, you know, this is for me. Yeah. I think it was for you. It was for you. It was for you. Yes. <laughs> Just for me. And you. And you. And you. <laughs> and you. And you. <laughs> It was for you. It was for all you ladies oh, out there. All you want. I see what's going on here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But you know what? I, I really love that video. I love it. You know, I just love the whole vibe, the whole the whole love thing. And when I say that, it shows you in a different light. Yeah. You know, you know, the soap is one thing, but in, you know, there's that crossover aspect. And I think that's why that I wanted to show that it was so important to show that. Tell me, you are you you writing these things? Tell me a little bit about your creative process. Yeah, this one was was written by me, all me, mm -hmm. and um, different songs um, have a different mindset for for, for all. Mm -hmm. You know, this one I was I was in studio and I was just vibes in. You know, that's what we say in Trinidad, have your vibes in. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. You know, and it just it just came up. It just came natural. You know, I didn't sit down to write anything. Mm -hmm. It just came natural to me, and I just went with the flow. Mm -hmm. You know, um, depends how you feel. Yes. You know, if you, if you go through something personally, you know, if you have a relationship problem or issue, mm -hmm. you know. So yeah, that's that's music. Music should should be life, mm -hmm. and it and it should be real. Yes. And when it's real, it's it's connected to the audience. And speaking of real, um, you know, you you did a song about the uh, I think it was in 2012 about the state of the emergency of Trinidad. Yeah. And um, you know, I, I, there's a quote that I that I have. It's by Nina Simone, and it always says that an artist has a responsibility to reflect the times. Yeah, it's. it's <laughs> That's how it is, you know. Yes. Like, that's how it should be. Yes. Um, the regular person on the street, they, they don't have a voice. As an artist, you have all media, all platforms mm -hmm. to, to represent them, mm -hmm. you know, to see what they're thinking, but they can't mm -hmm. say. Mm -hmm. You know, so I, I think it's, it's on us as artists, yes. you know, to speak the truth. Mm -hmm. And that's what we do in Trinidad and Tobago about cal Calypso music. Mm -hmm. Calypso music, different from soca. Soka was born out of Calypso, mm -hmm. right? But Calypso is really the voice of the people. Yes. Social commentary, political commentary, humorous songs, you know. So I started doing it in, in 2012, mm -hmm. and I believe that that has me growing, yes. you know. Because when you sing Calypso, you sing real stuff, you yes. know, a different audience. Yeah. Because you know? when I listened to it, you, were, you tackled some of the issues of the nation, yeah. um, Hands up. Hands up, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, uh, and, and that was real, that was real. That was real. You know, because the state of emergency, yes. you know, where you have a curfew and you need to get to your house at a certain time in the night, mm -hmm. sometimes they get caught outside and, and sometimes the, the officers or the police officers mm -hmm. use that as an excuse, mm -hmm. you know, to, to, to be violent, mm -hmm. you know, to be aggressive, mm -hmm. to be extra aggressive. Mm -hmm. You know, and people wouldn't mm -hmm. say these things, you know, I see it happening daily, yeah. you know, so I said it's only on me, is, you know, to put it in my song, mm -hmm. put it in my calypso and, and get it out and people appreciate it, yes. so um, I'm grateful I appreciate for that. it, yeah. especially in view of everything that's happening. Um, Black Lives Matter, all of these issues, they, yes. they're, they're just yes. the same here yes, the same as they thing. are there. Yeah. So I do appreciate that. Yeah, so that's, that's Calypso, Calypso, mm -hmm. you know, I do both. So now we, now we see that you are a broad <laughs> range. You've got the love thing, you have the social commentary. 
But we know that you have the soca. Yeah, the soca, the soca. That's, that's my love. That's your love. That's my love. Yeah, that's my love. When I see you perform, <laughs> I'm thinking, when is he going to get tired? <laughs> From beginning to end, fast paced, high energy performance. Uh, you look like you're having a great time and you're singing a song. And again, you've written a song that people could, it's relatable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, it's just music on the whole. Mm -hmm. You try to always sing something that another person can relate to, mm -hmm. or that they could picture themselves doing. So when I when I write or when I sit down to create mm -hmm. a musical, you know, composition, um, I try to picture m me as the as the audience, mm -hmm. as the spectator. Yeah. What would they enjoy? Mm -hmm. You know, and that's where we come up with the masterpiece. You know, and this song is just full of energy, full of vibes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I want to talk a little bit about, before we even show the video, your influences. Who shaped you? Hmm. A lot of things, you know. Mm -hmm. um, you know, special thanks to my mom and dad. Mm -hmm. You know, always, always been there, you know, for me. Um, not just in music, but I also am a sports person as well. I play football, I play field hockey, mm -hmm. you know, and um, they always there to give me full 100%, you know, from mm -hmm. small come straight up. So, mm -hmm. I mean, kudos to mom, dad, mm -hmm. you know, my little brother is Philly, he's my big brother, so <laughs> 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 I must say shout out to him too, you know, but um, family mm -hmm. is very important to yes. me. You know, if you follow me on social media, you'll always see me posting. If I'm not posting myself, entertaining i would always post family mm -hmm. that is number one priority for me mm -hmm. you know so my family shaped me to be the person i am today mm -hmm. and i'll continue to, mm -hmm. to to do them proud mm -hmm. yeah mm -hmm. and speaking of proud we're going to look at the video and the song is called give me space and we'll be right back don't go anywhere
So you guys saw that. I mean, <laughs> that's exactly how I feel. I mean, fire, 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 energy. I couldn't keep up. Now, when you say give me space, if I'm in a band and I saw you, I would give you your space. Yeah, you need to give me my space because I might bounce it up, I might push it up. <laughs> You need to get to do it, yeah. Let me tell you, and that's all, that's, you know, that's how I feel when I'm going across that. This is personal. When I'm going across the stage, yeah. that's how I feel. Yeah. I paid for my costume, I'm going across the stage, and you need to give me space. I'm a beast when I'm on stage. <laughs> I'm serious. <laughs> I'm so serious. You know what? I want to know, what were your thoughts about that song when you were writing that song? I didn't even, you know, I, I wanted to get inside of your head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, the song, the, the song was, was great. We did it in 2015, but released it in 2016. You know, and um, kudos to Tanesta Boxer. You guys made me my second star. Mm -hmm. Yes, you guys made me my second star. Mm -hmm. You know, but he's a personal friend of mine. I've known him years. You know, and his career is, you know, is, is going where, wherever he wants it to go. Mm -hmm. You know, so I'm happy for him. Big up yourself, second stand you're watching. Mm -hmm. You know, um, and we did it in studio. Um, he was the, the composer along with Kit Israel. Um, they part of Advocate Studios. You know, famous, famously known for the Can Can rhythm. Yes. That had the Ola Ola Ole and, and all these types yeah. of songs. You know, so I did this song the same time they were at the height, you know, mm -hmm. the production, you know, mm -hmm. process. You know, so it's a great song, you know, just vibes in the studio mm -hmm. and, and we got it popping, so kudos to Second Star, you know, we collaborated and came up with Kimmy Space, you know, and this is one of my most successful songs yes. to date. To yeah, date, yeah. I love that song. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so you know what we're going to do? We're going to take a commercial break. We're going to come back, and when we come back, we're going to go to Book Talk, Health Corner, Get Straight, and we're going to be back with more of Casey Cow. Don't go nowhere, we'll be right back. Made in Brooklyn, New York City. Elaine's! Tasty pepper sauce make everything taste good. It makes everything taste good. It makes everything taste good. It makes everything taste good. For all inquiries, please contact 646-657-4277 or email at Elaine's Tasty Pepper Sauce at gmail.com. Hi folks, you know who I am. I'm Shelby Smith of Shelby S Entertainment and I'm the host of one of the hottest shows, if not the hottest show in New York City and it's Simba NYC TV. A lot of you artists, you've been reaching out to me on Facebook and IG and saying that you want to be on this show. But you don't live in the tri-state area. So I'm going to fix that. We are going to be providing Skype interviews. I want to be able to show all the dopest artists, not only in New York, but all around the world. So, you know what you can do? You can reach out to me by my Facebook, which is Shelby Smith, by an email, which is S-H-E-L-L-Y-S-W-K-R-S-S at gmail.com. You can go to my entertainment page, Shelly S. You can also friend me on Skype. And the name on Skype is Shelda Smith. Send me a link to your music and your time zone. That's so important because I don't want to be calling you while you're sleeping. So link me, link me, link me. And you can be an artist on Simba NYC TV show. Yes, it's all about you. You want to hide something from a Negro, put it in a book. It's time for book talk. Welcome. And the name of the book is Lies My Teacher Told Me by Professor James Lowen. After surveying high school American history texts, he came to the conclusion that not one of the history text was doing a decent job. He saw these books as filled with mindless optimism, blind patriotism, sheer misinformation, and outright lies. So in this book, he talks, he tells the truth about Columbus' historic voyage, the lies surrounding 9-11, 
the Iraq war, and he gives an honest evaluation of our natural leaders. You know, again, this book is a must read. It is thought provoking. And the name of the book is Lies My Teacher Told Me by Professor James Lowen. Please read the book and see you next week on Book Talk. You want to hide something from a Negro? Put it in a book. Prevention is better than a cure. Health Corner. Welcome to Health Corner. And today I'm going to be talking about razor bumps. Yes. Razor bumps can occur on the face of any man who shaves. But if you throw curly hair into the mix, the likelihood of razor bumps popping up increases dramatically. Men of African descent, they typically have that wiry curly hair which more readily coils back underneath the skin. And after shaving, it can cause these unsightly and often painful bumps. Using a single razor blade in combination with pre-shave oil and aftershave lotion and shaving with, not against the grain, and also keeping your skin clean can be the best way to help reduce razor bump. What I'm going to give you is just some natural remedies that can help. Aloe vera, just snipping off the tip of the leaf and squeezing gently onto the skin, it helps to soothe the skin. A hot compress, it opens the pores, allowing trapped hair to become free. And witch hazel, it's also a natural antiseptic that reduces inflammation. Uh, lemon juice, tea tree oil, these are all natural antibiotic agents. If you know of any other natural remedies, please share them on our Simba NYC page. Thank you so much for joining us this week and I'll certainly see you next week on Health Corner. Prevention is better than a cure. Health Corner. I have to get straight now. I have to get straight. But I do not have it. I have to get straight now. I have to get straight now. I have to get straight. I have to get straight. We just do not have it. Hmm. British Historians and the West Indies by Dr. Eric Williams. One thing I could say about this man, a very intelligent man in truth. Half of the thing we write in this book is still going on today.
you know what? Best I call that. Tell that the way it is going on. Yes, I do it, sit, I do it, tell my dog, I try. I try. You understand? I try. Look like it's this boy. Hello? Daddy? What happened, boy? What going on? Wait, Daddy, boy. It's like I do it, you see, you know. I went down by she walk. You know what I'm saying? I waited she was coming out and leaving the room. And I try to talk to she and try to reason with she now, you know. And that's who she will look, you know. Don't let her see him mash me up now. I try my best to talk with she, but daddy, like she would have nothing to do with me, boy. Nothing at all. I try to hold she and she pulling away, all kind of thing. You know what I'm saying? And I just trying to deal with she calm and thing because me wanna make no scene by she walk and next thing I know is police and thing. So I trying to show she I love she and me in check for that girl, look how long me see that girl. But like daddy, she ain't wanna budge man. She ain't wanna she ain't wanna forgive my tour talking about you know, she she ain't thinking about no marriage and nothing. She ain't wanna hear more no marriage. Ah <sighs> boy. I right know that yeah, I don't know what to do again, nah. Me you know what to do again. Well, boy, I don't know what to tell you, now. Nah. If you did stay home and relax yourself and drink your soup little cool until you know you get yourself sorted out, you would not be going through this. But all the young people, boy. You're trying your best to get yourself straight. You understand? A little girl come and show you. She go look to organize the thing for you. You outside and party, but you're on that trees and, and all kind of thing. Eh? It's all you're going to be putting all yourself in this thing, you know? Me know to tell you again. All I can tell you, you got to keep trying, keep trying, and, and, and hopefully something will come. Look, 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 look. You see this? Look, it's best you talk to your mother, you know? It's best to talk to your mother, you understand? This is, this is too much of me. Talk to your mother. Hold up, hold up. Eileen! Eileen! Hello, everyone! Come, 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 come. Just go on the phone here. Come and talk to him. Talk to this boy. I, I don't know what to tell him again. I don't know. I was telling him about... doing something. Come, come, come. Talk to him. Talk to this boy. Talk to this boy. Gavi! Talk to him. Shit, man. Hello, son. Hello, mommy. I will just leave a little talk. Yes, I, I mean it with all this. Boy. Mommy, how you, how you going? You know, I'm always glad to talk to you. But I'm in my house clothes and I'm not going to get dressed to go with the church to, to take care of the sick. Everything all right, son? Mommy, in fact, tell you this, I might get vexed with me, you know. But, a little problem between me and the brother. I know if daddy tell you. Yeah, your father was trying to tell me something. But you know he just had his story wrong side. What, what happening with you and this girl? Well, here what is going on. It, it, it have a party up here called Under the Trees, right? And I just normally go to a party since I come up here. So I went to the party and I see a fella from the party named Sadis and a, um, a girl named Nikina that all of we used to go to school with, right? And well, when I see her, I didn't see her since Trinina, or since we didn't know come up, I think, yeah. That is the last time I see her. So when I see her and thing, you know, I start talking with her and thing, and a song come on, where all are we like now? Everybody like now. You know what I'm saying? We jamming still. Right? Hold them and walk them. So I take a little dance with she. 
And when I take the dance with Chino, she she um she record it. We dancing and thing and she put it on Instagram. And well Deborah ended up seeing it. No, mind you know, eh, mommy, I I didn't invite Deborah to the party, you know, but Deborah says she had also work at double, so she didn't go. See? So when I see the guy just take a little dance and it goes on the Instagram. And Deborah ended up seeing it. And since Deborah see that, like Deborah does get turned off at everything. She didn't want to take calls. She stopped taking calls. She didn't want to talk to me. She talking about, oh, let that girl who I was winding up in the party with give me my papers now. It's a real, she just like flipped the script. You know what I mean? It's like it's like in the movie now. A, a, a thin line between love and hate now. She like just flip on me and I trying to convince she. Up to yesterday, well, I, well when I did tell daddy when did it just happen, I did tell daddy what happened. Daddy tell me also go down by she work and thing and try and talk to she. And let she know, well look, listen. This scene here is a cool scene. So I do that. And when I go down by her, her job and thing and trying to talk to she, she pull it with her hand. She want to talk to me and she like, she ain't thinking about no wedding or none of that. She want to, in other words, to make a long story short, mommy, it's like she don't want nothing to do with me again since she see that. Gavin, Gavin Bishop, you have a nice, decent girl. A girl that want to marry you. A girl that want to fix your papers. What you doing outside in a club? Mommy, mommy, it wasn't a club, it's a, it's a party where, where all the trini everywhere, everybody just goes a big Caribbean party now. And I didn't see Nikki long time, and I just take a quick wine, that is all. Gavin, you know them club is the devil playground. Liquor, all kind of woman in all kind of skimpy outfit. Naked, winding up on each other. Gavin, that is a place that you should not be at all. Mommy, it's just one little party. One little party, everybody, you know, all the stress and we'll be dealing with here in America and thing, having to pay bills and all kind of thing. It's just want to give it a little bit sometime. Just to uh, just free up yourself a little bit now. That is all I was, mommy. I don't go nowhere so. Gabby, where's this Instagram thing? Is on is on the computer? Yeah, mommy, it's like you know, you know the Facebook. You know, I remember I was telling you about Facebook and to get Facebook, you want to get Facebook, but it's all you enable with that. Well, it's like that. And, and you, could, you, could, you could watch it on your phone, you could watch it on your computer, your, your tablet, anything. You could watch it. It's a thing called Instagram, which you could pop, you know, quick little, little short, short little movie-like thing. It's like that. You take a picture, you can take a video, and you paint up for people to see. And that is what she do now, you know, because you will be showing your friends and them what you're doing, you know? If you're, you're eating a pizza now, or you're, you're, not, you're in the barber shop, or, or like we wasn't in, 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 the, in the party. You know what I mean? It's that kind of thing. It just paid up quick. It's just like a minute long. So, Gavin, everybody see this whining behavior? Yes, mommy. Yes, and, and, and now Deborah taking it like, you know what I mean? I disrespect and she. And she ain't do nothing for me yet and look at what I'm doing. So she can imagine what will happen. You know what I mean? Down the road. And that she mother and she cause none of them was right about me. And look at that thing, boy, mommy. I don't know how the thing just turned just so. Gavin, I want you to pay close attention to what's happening. As soon as you start climbing out, and pushing your head up. You find a nice girl. She want to marry you. She want to give you your papers. All kind of things start happening. Gavin, I don't like to keep talking about church and about this and about that. But we living in the times where this is spiritual warfare, Gavin. And people don't want you to see you succeed. Mommy, I don't know. I just don't understand how that scene just 
everything was going good and every time things are supposed to look out for me, some kind of madness coming and happen. Mommy, I just wait to continue to pray for me. You know. Gavin, tell me something. The girl he was dancing with, she was enticing, she was sexy, pretty, big bottom. I know them kind of girl. Him. Yeah, mommy, she real nice and sexy. I mean, from long time since school days, but me studying that I just taking a quick wine, you know. Gavin, you see them kind of girl. Them kind of girl have a Jezebel spirit. So you know what a Jezebel spirit is? Them kind of spirit just come and mash up your home, mash up your life. Gavin, stay away from that girl. You hear me? All right, mommy. But she just, uh, you know, it's just, mommy, I never even see she before up here, so, you know, it's just a quick thing. I just see she quick, quick and easy, and it's a small thing, nothing. You understand? Nothing, mommy. Son, take my stupid advice. When was the last time, son, you went to church? I mean, since the last time I went and see Mother Mariah, that was the last time I was in our church. And I knew you tell me to go to church, you know, but I'd be so busy and thing not trying to take care of things now, I mean. You need to go to church. You need to keep yourself under the blood. Gavin, whenever you step out of God's covering, all kind of things will be happening to you. Gavin, you need to go back to the church. You need to go back and see Mother Mariah. Gavin, you cannot leave yourself exposed in this life. Okay, mommy, I will do that as soon as I get a chance, mommy, I will do that. Gavin, don't just tell me that, you know. You need to go back to that church. You need to go back and see Mother Mariah. Okay, mommy, I'll do that. Gavin, or else this thing just going to get worse and worse and worse. You see how it already start making your life topsy turvy? Yes, mommy. Gavin, don't feel you're getting out of this, you know. I'm going to call Mother Mariah as soon as I hang up here. And she's ex she's gonna be expecting you, Gavin. Gavin, this is serious. It's a real spiritual thing, boy. Too much of the spiritual thing, yes. This is what happens when you come out from under God's covering. God will not have to be God at all time, all time. It's God or nothing right now. Okay, mommy. Well, here it is going on. I know how much time. You know it is going already with this cat thing. All right, son. So we're going to talk. And then I'll go and see you as soon as I get a little chance, right? Love you, son. Love you too, mommy. Later. Later. Strong, always putting yourself in some mess. Gavin, me need to go back in a church every time you call me. I have to, you have to pray for yourself sometimes. Oh God, I don't want to all these people. See how my girl Deborah doing. I talked to Deborah in a bit. Hello, Deborah. So what happened with you and your boo? Well, they make up? Well, girl, you wouldn't believe what happened yesterday. Yesterday, you come by the job. And say, you know, you can't think. Tell me, sorry. And then he was trying to hold my hand. I took away my hand. 
I don't believe in nothing that my hands say. I tell him, you see, right now, I need a break. I need some space. I need to, I need to still think about this thing. I don't know. I'm so sure about this whole thing. Deborah, I have been your friend since junior high school, so I know you. And you see me? I don't like to hold my tongue. But Deborah, you get on real extra. What do you mean by that? What do you mean I get on extra? That's what you mean by that? Deborah, that man real love you. I know this. He come to make back with you and that's how you get on? Never just because that last boyfriend you had was cheating on you and you now you have a whole bunch of trust issues. You want to come and bring that same garbage to Gabby? Mm -hmm. Never every man is not the same. All I say is I give this man a chance so that he can get something good out of his life. Because it was on Facebook and Instagram, I think that is your problem. In it. You think people have time to worry about you and Gabby and who business? That is your problem. You living for people who see it, who ain't see it. Deborah, relax yourself. Ease up with this situation. I don't even understand that. Gabby is a grown man and he went out. You should see me when I'm out. But it's a big deal. So he danced with somebody. Is that you holding on to? and stopping yourself from having a good life? Listen here, Petra. I know what a dance is lead to it. I'm a trick. I know exactly what is a regular dance and a whining dance. You think I strip it? And I know what a dance could lead to. Deborah, you have a big imagination. You and I used to go out. I dancing with everybody in the party. I dancing down to the floor. With or without my king, that ain't no big deal. You gave yourself a whole lot of horrors for no reason. Deborah, you're gonna lose a good man, you know, for stupidness. Deborah, check yourself, you know. That's all I hear. Now listen, I on the move right now, I outside, and I gonna take care of some business. We'll talk about this guy we'll later. Alright? Alright, so we'll talk later. Bye. I for them is end up with no man. Making a big deal about her dance. Where's she from? She must be from the south. Yeah, we're bad. I'm exhausted. <laughs> Let me stop. No, but really. What's your next song going to be? Because it, it, it has to be about my experience. <laughs> It will be, it will be, it will be. You know, I don't want to let it that song, You can't tell me to get off the stage. <laughs> five more minutes. Five, oh, five more minutes. I think this song. Yeah, but then. Give me five more minutes. Give me five. <laughs> Remember, you had something like that years ago. You had somebody who wanted it 25 in. Oh. So, yeah, so. Well, I forget 27 <laughs> You can get anything you want. No, anything but, you want. Really, you know what? Thank you so much. You know, just having you here was an absolute 
truth. And you have to thank, we have to thank Sherwin. We're going to big up to Sherwin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When Sherwin called me and said, you know what, my cousin is going to be here from Trinidad, I was like, absolutely, absolutely. He is like an artist in his own right, but he's keeping it down. It's in his blood, you yeah, know that. It's, it's there, it's there. It's and there. I want to say thank you to him and thank you. You're on vacation, but you took the time to come here. But I'm just, you know, I'm so excited to have you here. <laughs> Tell me about you, your future plans, because I know you have some stuff cooking yeah, we in have, the works. We have, we have a lot of music. I mean, so so much things, you know. I can mention a few. Yes. You know, but um, before I do that, you know, I want to say thanks to you guys, you know, for having me. You know, I'm welcoming me with open arms. Yes. You know, it's a pleasure, it's an honor to be here. You know, to the world, mm -hmm. it's your boy Kyle Casey, can we remember the name? Mm -hmm. You know, and we have a lot of music coming for you guys in different genre, genres, mm -hmm. you know? Um, Carnival 2018 is, right, is, is basically here, mm -hmm. you know, it's basically here, mm -hmm. so um, we already have music there. Um, one of the main songs we're doing is, is, is a song by the name of Appointment, you know? Um, a kind of Bacchanal song, Bacchanal, you know, mm -hmm. it come on, street to um, street, yes. people know, with the Caribbean people know Bacchanal. Drama. Yes, drama. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's basically women always have an appointment, they're always going somewhere and some yes. of them use appointment as an excuse to do other stuff. Oh. Yes. So that. <laughs> So, so that is that's one of the songs that we yes. have that we have brewing, you know, um, and, and a couple more, mm -hmm. you know, and um, I expect to, to see more me, more me, you know, we working hard, you know, I must thank my cousin Sheila who always pushing me to do more, mm -hmm. you know, to always elevate yourself, yes. you know, always, always be diverse to different things, mm -hmm. you know, um, thanks to the supporters in Trinidad who always, you know, give me that extra support, you know, because our upcoming and a new artist is, is, mm -hmm. is not easy. Mm -hmm. You know, it's difficult, but you know, I believe um, what's for you is for you, yeah. but it's not going to come to you. No. You need to go at it a hundred, you need to go at it a thousand, a million percent mm -hmm. until you get to where you want to be. Yeah. You know, and I, I think I'm on, the, I'm on the right course, yes. you know, to get to my destiny, but I just need to be in a little more. Mm -hmm. I'm working hard, mm -hmm. you know, but I need to work harder. Yes. I know what I need to do yeah. and I'm going to get there. I heard someone say, "People, the hundred, add five more to them." Yeah, add, more. add, add keep five adding, more. Keep adding. Keep adding. Work, work harder than hard. Mm -hmm. You know, mm -hmm. work harder than that. Mm -hmm. you know, keep going. Keep yeah. going. If this and, is what and, really and this is why we are so proud to have some NYCT. Yes. For you. Yeah, showcase For emerging yeah. artists, um, this is the platform for it. Yeah. You know, unless you're already an established artist. Um, you get the recognition, but we want people to see you. Yeah. I won't be able to say later on, you know, he was on this show. Yeah, and I'll be, back, I'll be right back here. I'll be right back here <laughs> and say, you remember when I was here the last time? Yes. I'll be right back on this couch, mm -hmm. you know, chatting with you again and saying thank you. You know, but I miss, it's great for, for, for persons like yourself. Mm -hmm. You know, I hope this serves as, as an example, you know, so um, so other people could, could, could take it upon themselves to you know, to showcase mm -hmm. not only musicians, but anything, mm -hmm. you know, any individuals, the, the youth, yes. you know, upcoming and whatever talents that they have, whether it be sport, cooking, yes. you know, so I mean, this is great, we need more of this, mm -hmm. we need more of this. Thank you. <laughs> we want to follow you. Social media info, everyone needs to be able to follow Casey. Yeah, um, yeah, Kyle Casey Covey, mm -hmm. everywhere. 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 At Kyle Casey Cowie on Instagram. Mm -hmm. You can Google Kyle Casey Cowie and everything will come up. Pictures, videos, 
everything. If you go, if you're on Mars, if you're on Venus, <laughs> you can get Kyle Casey Cowie. I think, yes. I think I'm the only Kyle Casey Cowie. So mm -hmm. everything will come up once you mm -hmm. punch it in everywhere. Mm -hmm. On yeah. Facebook, you Kyle Facebook, Casey YouTube, Cowie. everything. Mm -hmm. Kyle Casey Cowie. Yeah, follow me. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining us. I hope that you had just a great as time as I did. Jai's life love and it's all we need and again thank you kyle casey cowley it's good it's and good. have a safe trip back to trinidad <laughs> i don't want to go back you can't tell me to go <laughs> you can't tell me to go because you see me i know i could be here to understand because i am always the man who have a plan mm -hmm. respect me now as the person that i am mm -hmm. my veteran boy you see me i don't really care for authority my friends tell me that I have no brought up see Don't bring more rules cause they don't make sense to me Just set me free Cause you can't tell me to go home When I cross any stage When I date a band Can't tell me Show with Chubby S Entertainment.